All right, everybody. We are here for part two, the back nine. <laughs> the back nine from the long tees. What's the score? I think you were heading me by two strokes, so you're one down and I'm one up. One down to one up? Well, let's get going on the back tees. What are you going to do this? What are we going to do a little different this time? Uh, I'm just looking to make sure my putting is... Fix that putting. <laughs> Fix yeah, that putting. the putting was not that great. <laughs> He's uh, releasing everything on a little bit of a hyzer, so we're going to see if we can get this figured out. So uh, let's go ahead and head on to hole 10 and... Uh, this disc golf battle started. Disc golf battle. There we are, hole 10, sunset disc golf course from the long tees. <laughs> Pretty difficult hole, <laughs> as he's laughing. Uh, left is the road. Yeah, it's out of bounds. Right, you have water the entire time. And that gap was about good 10 foot wide. It's about a 300 foot hole. I have my Z Undertaker that I just want to hyzer flip and just put down the fairway. And I just decided to hit a tree. And another tree. <laughs> What do you got here? Uh, my voyage. I'm trying to lay up and skip shot. Oh, you're just doing the layout, playing for a par. Yeah. That's a smart man. Down by two and still playing for par. <laughs> <laughs> I have my Prody Challenger here. I'm trying to go around the right side of this big tree and just have it fall to the ground all the way up to the basket. And. Uh, oh, almost. I barely. I got caught up in the limbs. What happened? I was looking to put it out more left. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. So I am, after seeing that, this disaster, I am probably, I don't even know. I am way out. <laughs> but, <laughs> I saved the par. Yeah, that makes up for the, the, the spit out earlier, don't you think? I think it does. Okay. And you're literally right next to me, so you have about the same distance. But I changed my footing because I was going for a jump. <laughs> you wanted this. I wanted it. You just made that putt, and I was like, uh. I thought you made it. I it's thought just, I made it too. Too much hyzer again. You're leaving your putts out there on a hyzer. That's football, but that's okay. Oh. <laughs> Let's move over to hole 11. I pick, Did I pick up a stroke? No, we both parred that. No. No, I you bogeyed. bogeyed it. Pick up a stroke again. I picked up a stroke. So hole 11, this is the local protein. Uh, I'm hearing this uh, thick crack on the <laughs> sidewalk. Uh, the basket's down there tucked against the edge. And I had my crystal nuke, and I sawed it off. What you got? My voyage. I'm looking to like, blast this thing down the road. He's got his voyage. Oh, oh it's the, man, you put a move on that. I, I saw you hit that tree, and I was like, this bird, is it's bird time. <laughs> He got a dead skip. He like caught the little divot, so he didn't get quite as much to the basket as he wanted. Uh, I got my zone, so I expect to be well, maybe what? not. Maybe not expect to be parked. Oh, I hit a tree. That's a very arid. I don't throw bad shots at that zone that often, uh, and then I don't blow over the basket that often. That's two mental mistakes in a row. Uh, I'm looking at a par save. You got this birdie run, kind of a death putt. Oh. And you hyzered it again. Yeah. Oh, so now I got this like 25 foot uphill putt. Yes, it's uphill in Florida. Don't be hating. Oh. So I'm looking at a bogey instantly. I got to make this. You got to make this to pick up a stroke. He was actually saying, there you go, before it even got to the basket. Then it almost didn't get to the basket. So I took a four that puts me to even. Yes. And you took a three, so you're still at two up. Yes. So we're here a whole 11. Hey, it looks like you're throwing another sidearm. Yeah. Three sidearms in a row. It's in the forage, yeah. The basket's just tucked up there. This hole's, uh, I think, around 250, 260. It's not that far of a hole. You get a pretty good skip. <laughs> you thought it rolled away. I thought it rolled away. I was like, no, 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 no. That's parked. I have my zone because I'm and pretty... And you ripped this. I, I was a little upset about sawing off that last hole, so I just decided to throw my zone up there and take some frustration out. <laughs> Uh, I got the V putt, just a nice little straddle putt, just put it in, circle's edge, just put it in, just don't even give it a chance. I'll take my par, and you are so parko that you're going to putt with the camera, aren't you? Yes, you yes. are. Uh, oh, Ooh. almost got him. <laughs> so that puts you to one up, one up, and, and I'm an even, <laughs> one stroke coming difference. back. He's coming back, folks. <laughs> So here we are, hole 12. You got your harp. And I turn, roll my wrist. One kick? Two, two kick? kicks? No, to maybe. the middle of the fairway. Oh, he's <laughs> sitting pretty for a putt. Uh, I got my Luna. Luna. Looking to go up the left gap around the big clump of trees and just hyzer in there. 
just highs are in there. So straight. It stayed so <laughs> straight. I'm surprised how straight this thing's gotten. And here you are around Circle's Edge. Again, just let it go flat. That's all I want to see is a flat putt here. Flat putt. Mm, oh, he's been hyzering all day. It looks like he just pulled it to the right to compensate Gee. for it. This is for Birdie to take a stroke back on you. Oh, yeah. Puts me to one down? Yes. And you're still at one up? Yes. If you make this. I was just looking at you to make sure you were rolling. <laughs> <laughs> On to hole 14. We have a really hard lefty hole. I have my <laughs> soft magnet here. I'm looking to hyzer flip it and miss this tree on the right. And I do. And I didn't do too bad. I don't you think that was too bad. do bad at all. Not bad. Uh, I'm down there. Got a birdie look. What do you got here? My Badari. Madari. Shout out to John Pyramid for giving me that disc. Oh. <laughs> shout out to the tree for stopping that disc. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a little harp action. I absolutely love this shot. I thought it was in. Oh, well, nice spoiler. <laughs> but it was not in, but I love the finesse on that shot. That was an absolute beautiful shot. So I, was, <laughs> I have about right Circle's Edge putt. I just, you know, I was like, eh, I can close this out right here. Just put it in. And I decided not even to give it a chance. <laughs> so we're stayed all even. Uh, we're at one over and even. Right? No, no one down. One down I'm one down. So I still got that two so shots. I have to put a move on the next couple holes. you got to do something. <laughs> I got my zone. I'm going to take it up the left gap. I throw it a little high and a little short. Oof. Oh, and you got a bad kick. That was a really bad kick. You got your A4. We yes. don't see this very often. And I felt really good about that shot. Yeah, you threw that just about as perfect as you could. Yeah, you peered. <laughs> it gave me that look. I was like, mm. <laughs> You peered the pure. Uh, okay, so we got that 40-footer. I got a little power line anchors to deal with here. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah. I think I'm beating you on putting today. That's pretty yeah. much all it is. It's just a putting competition. Uh, we get a star frame. Star frame? Uh, we, and I forgot to film the whole preview on this hole. Oops. Boom, boom. This hole 16 is about a 350 foot hole. I am looking to go up the left gap. There you go. There you go. Pure. Dude, that's pure. Right where I threw it. Pure. Except maybe five feet higher. So it would have got the distance. What's this disc? I haven't seen this one before. Uh, it's an X3 I got from the uh, Emocos. Our opening back tag round. Yes, opening back tag round. You smash this. Except for that last tree. But yeah. you put a move on that. That was going to get to the basket. That was a 350 foot drive. You just hit that last tree and you're throwing your harp. You kind of sawed that off a little bit, Chief. Me and the harper. You think that's sawed off? <laughs> Wait till you see this putt. <laughs> Spoiler. <laughs> I'll show you how to saw off something. Ugh. Dead on. Dead on. The ground. <laughs> You gotta save this par a little bit more distance than you wanted to there, huh? Yeah. Oh, hole Cursey. 17. Cursey. Oh, thank you for giving me that par. Hole 17. It's tucked down there. It's kind of a poke and hope when you get towards the basket. I'm gonna go on the right side of the big tree in front of us. Try to throw an Anheuser with a Thrasher. Mm, yep, that's exactly what I want to do. Uh, let's do that. <laughs> if I do that, I'm gonna get to the basket. That's not what I did. I, I mean, I try to throw a thrower or something. Thrower. I don't. I don't know what. Lefty thrower. <sighs> I just. I gave it the wrong angle. You got that X three again. Yes, trying to split it between those two trees on the right. Trying to hit the pro gap and, and he smokes it, man. He smoked that gap. And the fairway and the back. Man, you crush that. On a knee with a zip one. <laughs> oh, this got to be parked, right? It's, it's got to be parked. And Oof. yeah, can you, can you tell what my favorite disc is yet? I don't know. It's really hard to tell. <laughs> so here you are about that forty foot mark. Your favorite distance. <sighs> oh, that was a chance. It was. So a chance. I'm still maintaining that one shot lead going into eighteen. Yes. Eighteen's a toughie though. Eighteen's really Especially tough. Especially toughie. Uh, you got about three hundred fifty foot. I'm looking to hyzer flip something down that middle gap and just have it turn left to the big tree at the end. 
Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and tell you the footage cuts out mid-throw. I get about halfway down there and catch a tree and get knocked down. That's what happened to mine. You, are you looking big boy gap? Oh, I'm looking big boy gap. And I got it up to high. You hit quick. the gap, though. He tried to crush the big boy gap. That's almost a you know 380-foot throw, 400-foot throw up there. I got my zone. zone. To close it out. And... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You got a harp. You got to make this, but you don't know that. I think he gave it a run. Oof, yeah, you gave it a run. You see the reaction in your face. Uh, to save par. And that's how we're going to end this long team battle. I shot one down. Lefty from the pros, one down. Not, not too bad, shabby. not bad. You shot one up. Not bad, because we never we, we haven't been playing them in a long time. Yeah. That was a lot of fun, though. That really tested to see where we were. Uh, I can tell you right now that your putting failed you on that round. Yeah. You left a lot of structure putting. So... Until next time, guys, uh, looks like we're going to do a one-disc challenge the next time. Thanks to yes. AJ for saying that. And, uh, yeah, until next time, be better than yesterday. And finish strong. Finish strong. Finish strong.